Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Integrity Cells and Services. Folks, this morning, we are excited to give you a video of a very, very spectacular package. Folks, what you're about to view here is a 2000 Volvo WG model with a big 345 horse Volvo motor with an 8 speed transmission. Folks, John's going to, for starters, fire up this truck motor. We're going to get up close and let you hear and see it run. We're going to pull the dipstick, let you check out the engine oil and the bow by. Folks, by the time we're done with this video, our full intent is, is that you will know everything that you need to know about this package to make a buying decision. So come on up here. John's got the dipstick out. Let's take a look at that. Look at that nice clean oil, folks. No dirt in it. Very clean diesel oil. Now come up here and look at the blow by next. Now, folks, I was holding the video camera right on the dipstick tube. And as you could see, there's absolutely no blow by coming out of this engine at all. Now folks, while John has this engine running, he's going to go ahead and engage the air PTO and raise the box and hoist force so that we can get a good look at the bottom side of this truck. After that, we will be shutting off the engine so we can hear better in the video. And we're going to give you a very detailed look all around this truck. Folks, it's a very, very special unit. So what we're going to do is come around here and I'm going to go ahead and show you where we engage the PTO right here on the driver's side. Matter of fact, let's just focus on the body going up. John's got her engaged. Look at that. At an absolutely flat idle, that body goes up fast. I mean, I'm telling you, we never like to waste time. Look at that sucker go up. Now, <clears throat> John's going to shut it off there so we can hear better in this video and I'm going to come up close and give you a nice look underneath this body before he lowers it down. Now come up here folks and take a look. This is very very special. Folks brand new hydraulic reservoir, brand new twin cylinder Omaha standard hoist. Folks it's all here in one beautiful package. Take a look at this full double frame chassis. And I'm going to get the camera up close, boys. Right there are the two top lips of the frames. There's the bottom two lips. There is absolutely zero rust between the frames, folks. It's just like brand new. Take a look at these clean differentials. Flip around and look the back of the cab, boys. This paint is so shiny, you can even see John's reflection in that paint. Take a look there. Isn't that awesome? Now, folks, take a look at the bottom side of this platform. Now, this grain body on here is all new except for the platform. This truck came in with this platform mounted on its back. And what we done is took it off, sandblasted it down to bare steel, and built our brand new custom built grain sides on it. And folks, the reason we done that is it will save you the federal excise tax versus putting it all new. And look how well it's built. C-channel cross members, folks. Look at that. There's no lip here for the rust to sit on at all. Look at the gusseting she's got, and look at these 8-inch C-channel long seals, folks. Brand spanking new looking. We sandblasted it with the frame. This sucker is clean. Now, John's going to go ahead and lower the bed down while he does that. I'm going to come up front and give you a nice look under the hood before he lowers the hood. Now, look at these 20,000 pound fronts, folks. Four and a quarter, 22.5 steer tires rated at 20,000 pounds. Folks, look at that. 90% rubber. Come on down, take a look at the brake shoe area. You can see we have dual steering here. Everything is intact. No oil leaks coming out of this engine at all. Look at the motor block itself, the turbo, the air compressor, and the valve cover gasket areas. Folks, she's dry and clean, 100%. Here's your evidence of some recent AC work, new dryer on here. Folks, I'm telling you, we have went to the extreme on this truck just for you. The idea is, is that you get this truck, 
put it to work and have no problems and be very proud of it. Folks, take a look here on the driver's side. You're going to see an absolute duplication of a beautiful, clean, rust-free firewall, super clean motor block, no oil leaks at all on it, AC pump, allinator, everything intact and working. And take a look at that radiator core, boys. No oxidization going on there at all. Just look at those heavy, heavy spring pads. Folks, you've asked for it, and here you got it. I'm telling you, we have built a grain truck here that is the envy of all other grain trucks. I mean, this sucker is built with 20,000 fronts, 46,000 rears, full locking tandems, 8LL transmission, and a brand new chrome bumper to top it off. Isn't that amazing? Now, let's go ahead and square up on the front here, folks. Take a look at how this sucker shines. We got a nice custom grill in there, super nice sun visor above the cab there. It's just beautiful. And this blue paint buffed out like new. Folks, just take a look. Come up close and you can see she is absolutely awesome. And hey, by the way, if you're a true American, just look at this. Red, white, and blue, all for you. Man, is that wonderful. Just check it out. Now, let's come on back to our custom-built, time-tested, stamped rib design grain bodies. Folks, we have been manufacturing grain bodies and spin around here and you can see the hopper trailers since 1982. Folks, we have been in business doing just these since 1982. They are time tested and have proven in themselves over and over. Now, look how this stacks up on here. We have the overhang ratio on everything proportioned properly so that you cannot possibly overload your front axle. Now come up here folks, take a look at these nice meaty 22.5 drive tires, really sharp clean wheels, and look at those luggers on here folks, and I'm topping it off with a Volvo T-Ride suspension that cannot be broken folks. Take a look here, our grain body is special because you'll never break it. All seams are butted up and solid welded. Absolutely no overlapping of steel on this sucker, period. And remember, from right here at this platform up is all brand new material. Folks, including a roll tarp. Now, come on back here and let's take a look at the back end. Now, John's going to open up these cargo doors for us. It's equipped with the three-piece end gate system. You can open one door, two doors, or all three. And come on up here and take a look. Now, folks... As we look inside this body, I want you to really concentrate on what you're seeing. Now look at those tarp bows, folks. They're not just a typical bow made to shed the water. They are built like a truss in a barn and they hold those side rails absolutely together. Folks, you cannot break this truck. We have people that haul lime, gravel, anything imaginable in them and it will do the job. Folks, just take a look. Come standard with a smooth steel floor. No lip here to catch any grain. If you tip it up, she's coming out the back. And how about this P-Seal rubber all the way around so it will be leak tight for wheat or whatever, however fine a stuff you may want to haul. Now with that, John's going to close the back doors. You're going to see here it's equipped with three grain doors as well. The center door has a chute on it if you want to do auger unloading. Now just check that out. Ease of operation, folks. Now pop down below real quick here and I'll take a look at the heavy duty rear hinge system on here as well. Now folks, all of that again is brand new. The hinge, hoist, and everything above the platform. Now folks, Let's come on back and talk about another unit. Now, as you can see, John is pointing out to a, a very special piece. Folks, this little pup trailer will carry an additional 500 bushels. You gotta have a truck that'll pull it. If you focus on this truck, you've got the package. This truck has the power, it has the gearing to do it where you could legally run with a thousand bushels in this package or more. Folks, look at this. This is a custom built pup trailer made to go behind any tandem grain truck. Folks, we still need to put a rear panel hitch on this truck if you do decide to buy it together. I have them sitting here married up so you can get the concept of what's going on. So folks, again, Welcome to Integrity and look at this time-tested stamped rib design 
pup trailer. Again, approximately 500 bushel capacity made from the same time-tested stamped rib design that you've been knowing by Agri-Traders and Integrity for years. Now, come on back here. You'll see again, well-built, constructed with all solid welding, stamped ribs for strength, no skip welding around the hoppers. Folks, just feast on it and check it out. Everything is new on this trailer except for the axles. They are late model, rebuilt axles, and if you want them with new axles, that's your choice. They're available. Now, come on to the back, folks. John's going to open up this Sherlock roll tarp just to show you how nice it works. Now, look at that. Very effortless. Cranks are all the way open in just seconds. Now, come on up here with me, folks. I'm going to climb up the ladder and let you have a look inside. But first, take a look at the construction and the bracing under the rear and the front slope. Let's come in here and look down at the top of the suspension. Folks, there's the evidence of a rebuilt suspension with all new valves, hoses, brake shoes, and all. Now, look at this nice ladder that comes with standard equipment on all of our trailers. It comes right down to the ground where it's very comfortable to get on it and climb to the top. So folks, come along. Let's go take a look at the inside of this trailer next. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, now that we've safely reached the top, here you go again and look at the duplication of how we have our tarp bows standardized. And look at that big hole down there. Now, John, go ahead and open that rear door. Now, folks, you can see the, uh, the system is made with two doors. You can crank one to the rear, and he's going to crank the other one open forward towards the front. Folks, you can dump this whole load from one stop, folks. I'm telling you, 500 bushels kaboom in one stop drop. Folks, you've seen it. With that, we're going to head down to the ground and continue around this package. Jake, okay. I just want to show them how easy these doors crank open and close. You can crank them with one finger. I mean, it's just so simple. You can have your wife hauling in for you if you want to. They open and close just with one finger. It's just the ease of operation. Folks, as you just witnessed, what John is telling you is there is not a better functioning hopper door out there guaranteed. And I'm willing to put money where my words are. Folks, we have a special designed door that we have used since 1982, and we've found nothing comparable to it. Now, folks, I'm going to back off and give you a nice overview of this truck and trailer package from this driver's side perspective. Now doesn't that look slick, folks? I'm telling you, there's a package here like you've never seen before. We will custom build it. If you don't like this particular one, bring us your ideas. Here at Integrity, we have a full-time employed engineer and designer, and we will make what you want. You don't have to feel like you're forced to buy this package, but I'm telling you, our goal here and accomplishment we want to achieve is to get the message out there that we can do whatever you choose. Folks, with that, let's come back up here to the truck. Let's continue on up the driver's side. And remember, this is not being sold strictly as a package. You can buy the truck or you can buy just the pup trailer. Again, at Integrity, it's all about you, the customer. Folks, take a look at the drive tires. You can see everything matches here just like you've seen on the passenger side. Take a look for yourself. Standard equipment with LED lights. Nice steps up here at the front of the body. Take a look, folks. It's a one very super nice package. Look how easy John can climb right up that step and over the top. Now, isn't that beautiful? Now, folks, with that, we're going to get you a nice look at the inside of this truck, and then we're going to continue. Okay, come up here with me, ladies and gentlemen, and take a look at this spectacular blue paint around this cab. Folks, I don't know if it was always blue or not, but I see no evidence of any other colors around the trim, around the molding. It's a very, if somebody gave it a paint job, it's super, super sweet. Take a look at the nice, like new door panels, pocket holders, no cracks in the plastic, and folks, right here, are your hoist and PT, PTO controls. I can stand right here and raise and lower the body effortlessly while I stand here and look at the back of the truck without ever climbing in the truck itself. Now folks, 
I'm going to take a quick step up inside the cab and let you see a brand new looking driver seat and passenger seat. Look at the beautiful headliner in here folks. Shining back at you. Super clean dash area. Folks, I'm telling you, I don't want to be redundant here in this video, but I really do have a special piece here that you're going to go a long way to find a matching or anything comparable to it. Now, take a look. Here's the ID tag, folks. I want you to know I'm not only going to tell you things, I'm going to show you. There's the Volvo 345 horse engine. Right there's the 46,000 rears. And right down here is the 20,000 fronts with a 489 rear end ratio. So folks, you've seen it all. Now, we're going to cap up this video by giving you one final special treat. John's going to go ahead and jump in the driver's seat. We're going to join him in the passenger side, and we're going to take you folks for an actual virtual test drive. It's one thing to tell you about a truck. It's another one to show you. Now, I want to show you the nice door panel and everything here before we climb in. So come up here with me now, and we'll join John in the cab. And we're going to take you for a nice test drive today. And again, folks, this is not to try to impress you. This is simply to inform you that not only does this truck look absolutely beautiful, but it absolutely runs and drives that way. Now, John, let's come up here, and I want to show them how slow this truck goes in first and reverse. So put her in first gear. You got her in first, John. Okay, now folks, I'm gonna hold the camera right there out the window and focus. Now right there, we're at a flat idle, and I'm telling you, I think a Snell could beat us. That is how slow geared this truck is. Yet, it will run down the road 60 miles per hour. This is what you need for coming out of the field with the big power, boys. Now, with that, we're gonna go ahead and head out slowly here toward our country road. And our plan is, is to take you down the road and give you a nice show that this truck runs, shifts, and drives. Again, just as nice as it looks. So come along here. We're going to check for traffic. Looks good my way, John. And we're going to slip out here. And I'm going to show you that John will shift right through these gears. Now, notice, folks, it's nice and quiet in the cab. John is not even using the clutch. Look at that. There's the clutch pedal. He's sitting here shifting this thing, absolutely power shifting it without any problem at all. Look at that. Good power. I'm going to show you the gauges next, folks. Take a look here. Now, we just barely left the shop. We're already coming up on 35, now 40 miles per hour. Look at that. Volt meter. There's your oil pressure coming in at 60 pounds. 60 pounds of oil pressure. Now, look at that. Up to 50 miles per hour already. Take a look, and we've only went two blocks. Now, folks, that's all the evidence I can give you of power. John, tell them how you feel about it. Folks, you've heard the saying, if you can't run with a big dog, stay on the porch. This is the big dog right here. This is the truck you've been looking for. From the, from the rubber, to the suspension, to the engine, to the box, to the frame, everything set up just the way you want it. There's nothing more that we could add to this truck, and we're not hiding a thing from you folks. This is the truck for you if you want to get out and run with the big dogs and haul some grain. Folks, I don't know that there's any better way to summarize this truck than what John just done for us here. Folks, so I'm going to wrap up this video by expressing our gratitude to you for taking the time and watching it. Thank you for shopping Integrity Cells and Services. Folks, give us a call now. These trucks do not last, and I challenge you, find a sister to comp compare prices with. You're not going to find one to do comparisons with because they don't exist. Give us a call now. Our phone number is 260-238-5000, and our website is www. 99trucks.com that's the two number nines and the word trucks t-r-u-c-k-s dot com folks with that thanks for shopping integrity cells and remember john is standing by to take your call now